everyone. My name is Shivy Williams and I am your health, wellness, and fitness accountability coach. And I help you reach your goals by holding you accountable for reaching them. One way I do that is by offering you these free workout videos. I'm so excited about that. I hope they are working for you. Now, guess what we need to do? Let's get excited about today's workout. So let me welcome you today, 16. We are officially over halfway with this challenge. So welcome to day 16 of the 30 day challenge. If you are new, thank you for joining us. You guys, make sure you share this video so we can help other people on their journey or at least start their journey. Now, make sure you head over to YouTube, subscribe to my YouTube channel, LBX Fitness. The link is also in this post. So make sure you subscribe so that way you know when I post the videos. You can do them anytime you want. Also, you can do them if you have to play catch up. So we are doing two challenges this month. We are working our abs, right? And our back. So we're really working our core, which is from here to about here. So we also are getting in some other, um, working some other muscles as well. We're working our glutes, so our butt, we're working that, as well as our legs, our shoulders, our backs. So we got some other secondary muscles that are working in there as well. So here's the rules. Number one, always give 100%, right? I always tell you, you don't have to do what I'm doing as long as you are giving your 100% because my 100% your 100% are going to look completely different, and that's okay. Number two, take breaks. You guys, please take breaks if you need them. Again, you don't have to do what I'm doing. If you need to take a break, take one. I, if I can't keep going, and some of you have seen this, I will take a break. I don't care. We'll take a break. I'm gonna take a break, and then we just gonna jump back in with the exercises. Number three, Always, always, always give your best, right? Don't just do it just to be doing it, but have a goal in mind. You know, maybe last time you didn't finish, but maybe you did five last time. This time, try and go for seven. Again, it does not matter as long as you are giving 100% and doing your best. Now, I'm gonna back up here. So let's back up, let's get started. We're gonna start with abs first today. Remember, you guys, for those of you doing modified, Grab your chair and join us. Abs, we are doing crunches. So let's get on the floor. We're gonna do 35 crunches today. Let's lay back. If you're in the chair, you just wanna sit in the chair, just like this, sit with your feet flat on the floor. You're gonna crunch down like this. You're just gonna crunch down that way. So here we go. 35 crunches. Pretend like there's a apple or a tennis ball between your chin and chest. Don't move your head. You're looking up to the ceiling. If you're on the floor, make sure you tilt your hips up to the ceiling so your lower back is on the floor. Also, this activates your abs. When we crunch up, or if you're sitting in the chair when you crunch forward, you breathe out to activate those abs. Let's get started. Go. Up. One. Remember, breathe out, two. The goal eventually is to get your shoulder blades off the floor, four. Now those of you that need a little bit more advanced, six. What you can do is add some weight, seven. You can put a uh, eight uh, kettlebell or dumbbell, nine. You can wear a weighted vest, 10. I'm gonna put my legs up, one. So another way you can do the crunch, two. Three, four, remember, take a break if you need to, it's okay. Five, don't pull on your neck. Six, seven, your head should be resting in your hands. Nine, 20, here's another one. One, breathe out, two, crunch tight. Three, four, you take a break, just jump back in when you're ready. Six. Breathe out. Seven. Eight. Great job. Nine. We got this. Ten. Five left. One. Different. 
two, position, woo, three, my abs are burning, four, last one, up, five. Great job, everyone. Next are our heel touch. If you're in the chair, you're just gonna lean side to side, right? You just go side to side, and you wanna make sure you stay sitting up, don't lean forward. Heel touch, we're gonna go here, we're gonna touch our heels. You want your um, shoulders off the ground. Again, if your neck hurts or this bothers your neck, place one hand behind your head, and then twist that way. So I'll start off in that position so you see what that looks like, and then I'll move to no hands behind my head. So here we go, we're gonna do this, and then you're gonna touch your heel. Let's go. One, out, two, count it wrong, three, four, five, we got 35, six, woo, seven, eight, nine, ten. Take a break if you need to, one, Two, breathe out every time you twist, turn, four, five, whoo, six, we got it, seven, eight, jump back in when you're ready, ten, one, two, ow, three, it's burning, four, it's working, five, six, whoo, seven, eight, nine, five left. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh my goodness. Oh, that hurt. Whew, that was a tough one. I almost had to take a break. All right, you guys, time for us to do our plank. Now, before we do that, let me show you how to stretch your abs out after doing that. You're gonna come down on the floor, lean your hips, and just do this and look up to the ceiling, and that should stretch your abs. Ow! Okay, now, just make sure you're doing some stretching after you work out, after we do this. So we are doing 45 second plank. In the chair, you're gonna be in this position here, feet on the floor. On the floor, this is your alternative, or modified, just like this. Go on your elbows or your hands. So I'm gonna start our timer. Everybody ready? Let's get started. Now, I'm gonna stay here as long as I can. You can also alternate, squeeze your butt. Now, while I got you guys here, <laughs> make sure you visit my website, www.leadingbyexample.us for more great health, wellness, and fitness tips. Also, check the links out in this post. And on my website, I have where you can sign up for a free 15-minute consultation where I give you some tips on how you can successfully reach your goals. So if you're struggling reaching your goals, reach out to me. Sign up for the 15-minute consultation. Woo! If that is it, 45-second commercial. <laughs> Now, my abs are screaming. So, we are now done with our ab workout. Let's get to our back workout. And now that I'm here, I'm just gonna lay down and we're gonna go ahead and do our Superman, Superman first. Move Diamond, go. Of course, now she's got hair everywhere. So, Superman is first. We have two sets of these to do. We are doing this where I think Oh, 10 seconds. So, if you're in the chair, you're gonna lay across the chair, pick your legs up, hands are on the seat of the chair, right by your chest, and you can just pick your legs up like this, okay? So here we go, on the floor, I'll show you a couple different things. Let's get started, go. So this is the position here. You can also just do your hands, or just do your feet. That was fast. <laughs> First round is done. We gotta do this twice. Let's get ready for our second round. And everybody in the position, this time I'm just gonna do the full Superman, no modified. There we go. So I got my head up, not up bent. 
but just kind of looking at the floor, legs all the way up, feet up, legs and feet as high as they can go. That's it. Okay, so next exercise, bird dog. <laughs> so for the bird dog, if you cannot do your arm and leg and crunch in, that's fine. Just keep your leg up. This is the modified version on the chair. You can put your feet, um, hands on the chair and one leg up in the air. That's going to activate your lower back. So let's get started with bird dog. Even on the floor, you can keep it like this. Bird dog requires balance. So we have 15 to do. Let's get started. Crunch. One, two, legs up in the back. Three, this activates also your glutes or your butt. Uh-oh. Four, five, what else does this work? Abs. Six, let's go. Seven, breathe out. Eight, nine, great job. Ten, now when you guys finish, make sure you post done. Oh, I said 20. Oh, I went past. We're only doing 15. Let's go. Other leg. Let's go. One. Two. Three. I wonder if I only did ten. Four. <laughs> Five. Let's go. Six. Seven. Oh, I might have only done ten one. Eight. Nine. Here we go. 10, 11, 12, let's go. 13, 14, 15. Great job, everyone. I'm miscounting on the first one, I think. I don't know, I can't remember now. Bridge, we're doing 17 bridges. Now, on the chair, you're still going to be doing the same thing we're doing. It's just that your back is on the chair. Okay? So, get my clothes here. You're going to take your hip and you're going up to the ceiling like this. This is going to activate your butt or your glutes and your lower back. Okay? So, again, you can add a dumbbell or a kettlebell to add some extra weight. Here we go. We got 17 to do. Let's get started. Up, one. Slightly touch your butt to the floor, two. Breathe out when you go up. Four. Five. Six. Squeeze tight. Seven. Eight. Go up as high as you can. Nine. Ten. Seven more. Seven. Squeeze tight. Six. Five, let's go. Four, we got this. Three, two, last one. Great job, everyone. Guess what? We are now done with today's workout. Great job. So proud. Mm, strange dog. So proud of you guys for getting it done. Thank you so much for joining us today. Make sure you check out the links in this post for your free offers. So if you eat out a lot, it's summertime. A lot of people on vacation, you're eating out. So I have an offer for you on eating, how to eat healthy on the go. Again, sign up for your free 15-minute consultation with me. I want to help you reach your goals. So make sure you sign up for that. Now, you can go to my website, www.leadingbyexample.us. For more great health, wellness, and fitness tips, sign up on the website for your free 15-minute consultation. I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh, before I go, make sure you share this video and let me know if you guys are seeing any changes in your body from this challenge. I want to know. All right, you guys. See you tomorrow for day 17 of the challenge. Bye.